On the 6th of May, as over 2,000 guests attend the coronation of King Charles III, present among them will be an Indian origin chef. Her name is Manju Malhi. In fact, she has been named on the list of community champions who have been invited to the King's coronation ceremony. And earlier, we met her at St. Charles Hospital in North Kensington here in London. And this is where she runs a program to teach cooking to senior citizens. And we spoke to her about her charity work, the work that she does for the elderly and her expectations from the ceremony, her life in the UK and of course about her Indian identity. Here's a detailed report. Meet Manju Malhi, an Indian origin chef who has been invited for the coronation ceremony of King Charles III. She is the winner of the esteemed British Empire Medal for helping senior citizens in the UK through a charity called Open Age. This organization champions the cause of an active life for the elderly. During the COVID-19 pandemic, she taught hundreds of elderly stuck at home how to cook a wholesome meal and stay busy. And impressed by her stellar work, the king has invited her to witness his coronation. We decided to talk to her about that invitation and we travelled all the way to St. Charles Hospital in North Kensington. This is where Manju runs a fun and educational cooking class for senior citizens. You could see them chopping onions and peeling gingers, with the chef herself busy cooking sumptuous meal. Food is a great way to bring people together, especially during times of crisis. And we saw a sample of that during the COVID-19 crisis, which engulfed the entire world. And tonight, we are making you meet Manju Malhi, celebrity chef, cookbook author, and someone who has been lauded for her work during the COVID-19 crisis. In fact, that is the reason why she's also been invited for the King's coronation ceremony. Malhi's students, although older than her, are fairly obedient. They listen to her with patience as she teaches them recipes of what she calls Brit Indie style of food. A style which mixes Indian and Western influences. We are very lucky. We, she, she, she makes beautiful dinners, inexpensive dinners, to, to, to more to the point, and she teaches us how to uh, chop food and mix it together, and, uh, and, and yeah, it's, it's, it's been a uh, plus we socialize together here as well. Mali has been conducting such classes for quite some time now, but they picked up pace during the pandemic by becoming a tool for the elderly to beat lockdown blues. There was a, a lot of fear about older members of the community hmm. contracting coronavirus and, you know, getting really ill. Right. And uh, there was, you know, the government was so worried that they told a lot of us to stay indoors, most of us to stay indoors. Right. So what we do is we do conference call cooking sessions where we'd phone everyone hmm. and uh, we'd talk about whether we could get hold of ingredients, hmm. whether we could... Um, sort of uh, buy and purchase ingredients because there was a shortage yeah. and also what they were eating because people were just eating cake and lots of people were cooking which was a good thing but mm. maybe not the right things <laughs> so we were checking up on them uh, and it was helping isolation and feelings of loneliness that a lot of us were experiencing mm. it was so out of the blue this you know we didn't know what we should do from one day to the next so it was right. a great routine for all of us including me her work will now take her right to Westminster Abbey on the 6th of May as she attends the coronation of King Charles III. And how excited is she for the ceremony? In one word, quite. Well, um, I've got a nice number that a friend of mine has decided to run up for me because I can't afford designer clothing. <laughs> but she's an independent British Indian designer. Her um, name is Geeta Handa. Okay. And she's going to make uh, Indian cotton, hmm. salwar kameez, with a British element. The blue colour is a British element. Right. So, and very 1940s style, because huh. that's when King Charles was born during the 1940s. Right. So she's got elements of British and Indian. Malhi is a professional chef who, since 2016, has acted as the resident chef for Open Age. 
She spent several years of her childhood in India, where she explored varied cuisines of the country of her heritage. And here's what she had to say about her life back home and her favorite dish. I love aloo. Doesn't everyone love potatoes? Of course. <laughs> so I just like basic aloo with a bit of turmeric right. and uh, red chili. That's it. That's my favorite. I love dal. People say that's so boring. Dal is so boring. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I, I, I like those sorts of things. Malhi's story is a source of inspiration. The daughter of Indian immigrants who settled in the UK will now be witnessing the crowning of the king right next to leaders and dignitaries from all over the world. This is Molly Gampir reporting from London for We On World Is One. We On now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the updates on the move.